students a pleasant and cheerful good morning to all of you this morning i want your total attention to the lesson i am going to discuss with you the name of the story is an alien hand its writer is jayant narlika the name of the story is an alien hand its writer is jayant narlika students the story takes us to the planet mars the story begins with a small kid tillu who lives with his parents and other people beneath the surface of the planet so tillu lived below the surface of mars as an extremely curious child tillu wants to know about his father's job his father used to go for work through a secret passage it was a forbidden passage tillu was not allowed to use that forbidden passage one day tillu got his father's security card and made his way through that forbidden passage to reach the place where his father worked in fact tillu was trying to go to the surface of the planet but he was caught by the security guard and was brought back home tillu's mother was very angry but his father explained everything clearly to him he told tillu some secrets about their living in the mars tillu's father told him that once their forefathers lived on the surface of mars there was a change in temperature and it became difficult to survive on the surface of mars animals and plants died human beings survived with the help of superior technology but they were forced to live in an underground homes with the help of machines tillu's father's job was to keep this machines in good working conditions one day scientists on tillu's planet observed an alien spacecraft so it became clear to them that there was life on other planets also the president announced that there were two aircrafts one was orbiting their planet and the other was still far away the president asked the opinion of his colleagues in the control room a person in charge of defense said that they should not destroy the approaching spacecrafts but they could make them ineffective after their landing a second person who was scientist recommended non interference and passive observation they should only watch and observe without doing anything a social scientist said that they must limit their surface activities so that their identity does not get revealed in the meantime the president got a message that the first aircraft had landed the next day tillu's father took him to the control room he was very excited he could watch the alien spacecraft on tv screen 
the tv screen showed a mechanical hand emerging from the spacecraft tillu was excited and in excitement he pressed an important red button on the panel the mechanical hand from the spacecraft ceased to work the mechanical hand was trying to collect samples of soil from the surface of mars where had the spacecraft come from the spacecraft had come from the earth meantime a nasa scientist was holding a press conference he informed that their viking mission to mars was going on smoothly but they had to face a small problem a mechanical hand that was to collect the soil samples had stopped working another announcement said that the hand was working again but the soil samples it collected could not prove that there was life on mars nasa scientists were disappointed there was no sign of life on mars so students the viking mission of nasa to find life on mars failed students how do you find the story exciting isn't it of course do you want to visit mars wait for your chance